Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I got a great one for you. We are gonna be working the lower half of our body. Yes, it is leg day. We are only gonna be doing three exercises, so we're gonna keep it very simple, but don't worry, it's gonna be effective. All right, come join me, stand on up. Let's have our legs nice and wide, as wide as you can without doing the splits or anything. Toes are facing forward. And while you do this, um, exercise I want you to be cautious of your chest okay I want you to make sure your chest is up and that you're looking forward um, towards me what we are going to do is we're going to bend one of our knees our arms are going to go down in between right like this and then we're going to come up arms are going to go straight in front of our chest we're going to open them super wide squeezing those shoulder blades behind us going forward again and then we're going to bend the opposite knee going down here and then right back here and repeating. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Bend the left knee, bring it up, open. Close, bring the right, bring it up, open. Now when you go down, I want that chest to be up. All right, you guys, I don't want you to bend over that knee. Make sure that chest stays up. Now, if this is too far for you, you can do this. That works just as good. So you can go down right here. If going down that deep like we were is too much for you, this works as well. Remember, this is your workout. Give it all you can, whatever that looks like. We're gonna open wide. Go all the way down to that ground if you can, keeping that chest up. And when you go back, I want you to make sure that butt is behind you. All right, I don't want you to bend forward with that knee. I want you to go back with that butt. So pretend you're sitting down behind you. Oh, somebody's dog sees me. Down and up. Nice job, guys. Over to that side, getting that butt behind you. Open those arms and close them. Make sure your arms are level with that chest. Really squeeze those shoulder blades behind you. Right here. All right, you guys, we have one more. Go down, open big. Nice, all right. Keep your legs as wide as they are. I'm just gonna adjust mine just a little bit. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down into a deep sumo squat, but we're gonna keep our toes facing forward. Now, usually in sumo squats, I tell you guys to open your toes out. I do not want you to do that this time. I'll explain why in just a second. We're gonna sit down with our butts in prayer position. You're gonna step to the side, step to this side, and we're gonna stand up and I want you to push your palms behind you and then right back into prayer, okay? So the reason why we're not turning our toes out is because we're stepping side to side. All right, you guys, you ready? Here we go. Squat it down like you're sitting down on a chair. Put it together, put it together. Stand on up, squeeze those butt cheeks behind you, pushing those hands down. Left squat back again, right, left. Stand on up, pushing behind you, squeezing those cheeks. Step, touch, up, nice. Step, touch, and up. I have a long car trip tomorrow. I'm starting to realize this might not have been the best choice. <laughs> nice job, guys. And up. Our butts are going to be sore tomorrow, but it's gonna be a good one. Stand up, bring it down. Now, if you can't go this deep, that's okay. Let me show you an alternative. Just go down a little bit right here. But I still want you to have that butt back behind you. Do not bend at the knee. Get that butt back like you're gonna sit in a chair. So this is an easier one. If you're a beginner. No shame in this at all. If you don't want to squat, getting too tired, prayer, step, touch, push it back. Prayer, step, touch, push it back. Give me one more deep lunge if you can, or squat, excuse me, not lunge, and push it back. Nice job, guys. For our last exercise we're gonna do, we are gonna do a curtsy lunge, okay? So what we're gonna do, what that looks like, we're gonna add a curl. You're gonna uh, put your right leg cross behind you nice and far, 
and your left leg is going to bend while you curl your arms and then come right back here. Let me adjust myself so I'm in the middle. Step back the other leg behind you and right here. All right, you guys, join me. Cross that right one behind you nice and far though. Bend it down and then right back here. Cross it behind you, bend it down and then right back here. Nice job, guys. Cross behind you, bend and then up. Cross behind you, bend and then up. I do want you to do this with a little pause where we're stepping behind, pausing, bending, pause, and then right back into the middle here. Nice job, guys. Awesome. Now, if that is too hard for you, you can just simply step backwards and curl and then go right back here. Just step it back behind you, curl, and then right back here. Step behind. If you don't want to add that lunge part, you don't have to. Step it behind and curl. All right, I'm going to add those lunges. Nice job. All right, you guys, we have two more of these. Here we go, one on each side. Make sure to step really far back. Awesome. All right, you guys, that was step one. I mean, set one, now it's set two. So here we go. Open up nice and wide again. What we're gonna do is do side lunge. If you can, go all the way down. But if you can't, that's okay. Just go down as far as you can. We're gonna sit back with our butts. Here we go. Bend one knee, straighten that other leg. Bring it up middle. Open up, squeezing those shoulder blades. Down to that other side. Side to side. Open wide. Squat it down. Open wide. Squat it down. Making sure that chest is up. Now remember, if you don't want to go down that far, you can go right here. All I ask is that butt still goes back behind you and that you're not bending at that knee. What I mean by that is you're not going forward, okay? Why don't you go back? Oops. Nice job, guys. You don't have to go down far to get a good workout here. All the way down and up. Making sure that chest stays up right there. Nice. Open and close. Down, open, close. Nice. All right, we have one more on each side, guys. Awesome, last one over here. Great, all right, keep those feet where they are. I like to just bring mine in just a tad bit. If you wanna do that, go right ahead. If you have weights, you can hold your weights together or you can ditch them all together with this next one. This is the one where we are doing a squat and then we're doing side to side touch and then stand up and we're pushing them behind, okay? If you are holding weights, hold them in a hammer hold. All right, you guys ready? Squat down in a prayer position for me. Step to one side, step to the other. Stand up nice and tall, push behind you. Down, step, step, push behind you. Great, down, step, step, and behind you. Stomach in nice and tight like always with all of the workouts we do. Keeping that chest up, look at me. And up. If you can't go down that deep, just go right here. Step touch. And then up straight. You can just go a little if you want. And straight. You don't have to go down that deep if you don't want to or if you can't. Or you can just do step touch prayer and then push behind you. You can do step touch and then behind you. Or go all the way down. Step touch it. Bring it up. All right, you guys, one more. Bring it down. Bring it up. Nice. All right, we are going to do those curtsy lunges now. Get your feet just, just hips apart, maybe a little bit more than hips apart, but not too much. We're going to swing that leg. Well, not swing. We're going to place that leg behind us, across behind, 
while curling our arms. Here we go. Step far behind. Bend that front knee up. Other side, alternating. Bringing it down, up, right back to the middle. Step it back, curl, up, middle. Step it back, curl, up, middle. Nice job, guys. Step it back, curl it, middle. Nice. Step it back, curl. All right, if you don't want to do that lunge, this is what you're doing. You're just going to step back. Give me that curl. And forward. Step back. Give me that curl. And forward. If you are holding weights, it is a regular curl, so palms are facing up. And I want you guys to give yourself an extra squeeze when curling. Nice job, guys. All right, we got four more. Here we go. Step it behind. Bend. Up. So you are bending while you curl. All right, here we go. We have two more. Step it back. Bend. Up. Other side. Step it back. Bend. Up. Woo! Nice job, guys. All right. Here is our last set, guys. Set three. You got this. It's only three moves. Come on. We can do this. This is it. Let's bring it home. All right, you guys, toes facing forward, legs nice and wide. We're gonna go down to a side squat, bring it up in the middle, open wide, off to the other side, alternating. Here we go. Bring it down, sit that butt back, chest up, open, together, other side. Bring that down, chest level, squeeze those shoulder blades, bring it together, chest level, bring it down the other side. Really make sure that butt is sticking out behind you. Sit back. Watch that knee. You don't want it to go over those toes. So sit back like you're sitting on a bench. Now, if you don't want to bend, for those of you who aren't bending, that's okay. This is what you're doing. You just do a slight bend and then open. Slight bend and then open. But you guys still is watching that butt. Okay, don't bend at that knee. You just wanna be right here. All right, you guys, we have four more. That's two on each side. So here we go, down, chest up, open. Down, chest up, open. Two more, here we go. Finish it strong, guys. This is our last time. Last one, over to this side. Open up, woo, nice job, guys. All right, I'm gonna bring mine in just a little bit. Toes are still facing forward. We're gonna go down into that deep squat into a prayer position. If you have weights, you're gonna hold them in a, a hammer hold. All right, we're gonna go side to side and we're gonna push back. You guys ready? Here we go. Down into a deep squat. Go one side, go another side. Push it up, palms behind you. Squat it down. One side, other side, push it up. Nice, squat down deep. Right, left, up. Keep that chest up for me, guys. Don't be like this, I know you're fatigued, but keep that chest up, okay? Keep it up for me. Nice, if you can't go that deep, just go a little, right here. This works too. Woo, squeezing that butt cheeks when you come up. Right here, stand it up. So you don't have to go down that deep if you don't want to, or just do a step touch. Prayer, push it back. Prayer, push it back. Nice job, guys. All right, we're gonna do two more. Bringing it down, if you can, wherever your level is, and push it back. Prayer, and back. Nice job, guys. All right, we're almost done. Hang in there. This is our last move, guys. And then we're gonna stretch out. We're gonna do our calming breath and then we're gonna get out of here. Let's do those curtsy lunges. I'm gonna take my right leg, swing it back behind me. Nice and big. Drop it down and curl. Other side. Left leg. Bend that right and curl. 
and back to the middle. Give yourself a pause here. Step it back. Now bend and curl. Back to the center. Step it back. Down and curl. Back to that center. Nice job, guys. Pausing between each one. Right here. Now remember, if you can't go down that deep, that's okay. You can do this. Just step it back. Okay, if you can't bend because of knees or whatever, just step it back and then curl. Right here, this is just as good, guys. You're getting a good workout too. All right, you guys, we're gonna do four more. Here we go, lunge it back, bend. Right here, lunge it back, bend. Right here, two more, guys. Give me that curtsy up. Give me that curtsy if you're doing it. And up. Nice job, guys. You did amazing as always. <laughs> Sorry, my youngest is over to the side. I'm not sure if she fell trying to do a cartwheel or not. Okay, she's good though. She's all good. Thumbs up. All right, you guys, knee to knee. You can grab something, put your arm up or in front of you. But we're going knee to knee. That's when you grab that one leg. Bring your knees together. You can feel free to hold on to something if you need to. Or some people like to hold from their shoe or pants if you're wearing them. Switch, other side. Nice job, guys. All right, let's go nice and wide. We really worked those legs. Let's go into a side lunge, just holding it. We're not gonna go that deep. We've already done enough side lunges for the day. <laughs> all right, bring it all the way down the ground if you can. If you can't, keep holding it right here. All the way down, bending that front knee right like that. This other foot is still facing you guys, the toes are. Nice, slowly bring that up. Other side, just in a lunge. All right, if you can, you're gonna, we're gonna go all the way down. If not, hang out right here. Go all the way down, bending that front knee, keeping that other foot facing towards you. So my toes are facing you, so your toes should be facing me. Keeping that chest up, and just hold. Nice, gently come up. Now I want you to turn your toes out. I'm gonna shuffle my feet a little bit in, a little bit more right here. We're gonna go down and we're gonna open up those knees. Opening up that hip flexor area. Nice job, guys. Straight back, I want you to drop down, curving that back, slowly roll it up, and we're gonna go back down, opening up those legs, and hold. Drop one shoulder, back to the middle, drop that other shoulder, Back to the middle, flat back, all the way down, slowly rolling it up. Nice job, guys. Put one leg forward, one leg back. I want you to bring that front knee down, really push that one behind you, and go forward. Go as deep as you can with this one. Bend that back knee down to the ground, and I want you to go forward with that front knee, you should really feel that hip area. Bring it up, straight leg in the front, straight leg in the back. Now, if mine doesn't look that straight, ooh, if mine doesn't look that straight, it's because I do have arthritis, so there is a slight bend in my knee. It is as straight as I can. Get your leg as straight as you can. Bring your arm right here by this knee. Open up your body. Get that arm up if you can. Turn and face this arm up here. I am not able to do that because of my spine, but if you can, go for it. And slowly come up. Nice job, guys. We're gonna do the other side. Bring that other leg in front. Other one behind us. Scoot it back pretty good. Front knee, push it forward. Make sure your hands are not by that kneecap. You want it up by your thigh. Drop down onto the ground and push the knee even further. Nice. 
I slowly come up, straight legs, both front and back. So both my heels are on the ground. Front, um, the leg that is straight, the arm is gonna go in front of that knee, right like this, like you're giving me a high five. Other arm up into the sky, turn and face it if you can. <coughs> Excuse me. And hold. And release. Nice job, guys. All right, like always, I want to leave you with a calming, cooling breath. <coughs> Sorry. It's springtime. I get the coughs. All right, allergies. I'm not sick. All right, you guys, we are going to slowly inhale through our nose, filling up our lungs nice and slow while lifting our arms up to the side. We're going to hold it on top. Then we're going to exhale nice and slow and long out of our mouths, bringing our arms down in front. We are going to do this three times. You guys ready? Here we go. Inhale through the nose. Hold. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale, hold, exhale, one more time, up, hold, down. Awesome job guys, you did amazing. Let me know how those legs are feeling, are they feeling a little jelly? Give me a thumbs up if you haven't yet and subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell icon. It notifies you when I post a new workout so you can keep healthy with me. Here's to a healthier you. Peace out from Illinois.